Welcome to the second episode of the 40 year old recurve bow. I have my stuff set out here and um, I'm gonna put together the bow. Um, as you can see I have some stuff laid out. Um, I have some old sight that I bought in uh, a store and then I have some basically new Arten stabilization uh, and I found this one, it's just a generic generic stabilizer that I bought with the bow. I think this was on a marksman that I bought once. Um, and then some, some other art and stuff to finish the whole deal. Uh, and I made myself, uh, or actually I asked uh, somebody to make a background string. So if I put this together I should have the bow set and then I can go with uh, the Aramis next week. So uh, let's get this thing started. So some people might have already noticed, uh, there's no center serving on this string yet. Uh, that's because I don't know which arrows I'm going to shoot and which knocks are going to be on those arrows. So uh, before I make a serving I first want to make sure that the arrow will actually fit the string. So that's why there's no center serving yet. The brace height's a little low still, so uh, I'm gonna need to give this string a few more twists. But that will just mean that the string is a little more uh, stretchy, so that will not put too much stress on the limbs. So the bow is strong. Now I guess the most logical step for me, at least, is to put the stabilization on. So I'm gonna do that right now. And then I have this sight. I think it's just a generic sight, um, but it looked old, uh, and I think it fits the style of the bow. So I'm gonna put this one on. A little tip for if you're putting a sight on your bow: um, don't start tightening the first screw already when the second screw isn't in already. Um, Make sure both screws are in the holes and then tighten them up so that they are properly aligned. So that's that done. I think the side pin should go outwards a bit, but before I can actually say that, obviously we'll need a plunger. Um, I found this plunger in my storage room. And I think it's just Shibuya plunger, and I'm not sure if they were around back then, but um, it looks old enough for me. I'm gonna put it out a bit because it, the center shot will be too much inwards now, but uh, it looks old uh, and it's as generic as they come, I think. So um, I think, again, it fits the style of the bow. And it's not really about if it was around back then, but more if it fits the style, and I think. Uh, I think I'll score some style points with this. All in all, I'm really happy with how the bow is uh, turning out. I'm hoping that it will shoot as good as it looks. And um, uh, after I get some arrows, I will shoot a club competition with it. And I'll let you know how it goes and uh, make sure to film it all. See you next week on a new episode of Triple Trouble.